Once you have found center on your truck and center section, you can begin tack welding the bumper kit pieces in place. Refer back to the provided instructions for your specific bumper kit to understand how to tack weld the center section and wings of your bumper kit. Take notice of the provided curvatures of your vehicle compared to the bumper kit. Properly ground your welding machine to the project itself. We recommend grounding the welding machine to the frame mounts. Realign the center section if needed and tack weld the center section to the provided frame mounts on both sides. You may need another person to help you hold and align the center section. Some customers have used hydraulic floor jacks and straps to help hold the center section in place. Once you have the center section tack welded in place, we recommend confirming that the center section is still aligned with the center of the vehicle. Then place your W1 or wing 1 section to your center section, maintaining a good even gap to your vehicle. Make sure that the center section and the W1 is flush prior to tack welding. Next, place the W2 or wing 2 section to the W1 or wing 1 section that you just tack welded. Again, make sure that the W2 and the W1 are flush prior to tack welding. Finally, if applicable, insert patches as necessary. Make sure to cover any part of the vehicle with a welding blanket that you feel is necessary to protect. Repeat the previous process by connecting W1 or Wing 1 on the other side to the center section. Place the W2 or Wing 2 section to the W1 while making sure that the pieces are flush. Tack weld any insert patches and while protecting and covering any part of the vehicle.
the main part of your bumper kit is now tack welded in place.